All right, come on in, hit the like button, think about subscribing if you're already. If you're new here, welcome to the channel, but most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is my personal opinion slash review for 2023 season one of the show called Silo. It's an Apple Plus streaming exclusive series that is based on a book. Now here's the plot. In a ruined and toxic future, a community exists in a giant underground silo that plunges hundreds of stories deep. Their people live in a sorority full of regulations they believe meant to protect them. Now here's the cast. Now I love this world the creator has built. Granted, all the laws are pretty stupid and this question about best. Just to name a couple of the laws, you have to be approved to have relations and you have to have, be approved to have get pregnant, which I get, but it threw, throws up a red flag at the same time. Also against the law to request that you want to go up and clean the screen viewing the outside. But if requested, they have to abide by it, nonetheless. Now the silo holds around 10,000 people. I believe I couldn't fully understand that or figure it out. Um, but let me know in the comments below if the people have read the book or just caught on to the part where they actually say how much. Uh, at one point I thought it was like 500 or 5,000 and then it was like 10,000 or 50,000. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below because it would really help out. Now you add extra floors to that with for food, water, power, and government offices, etc. To the amount of housing and uh, then you can imagine the, that this is such a huge silo. This imagine the size of that sucker. But for some reason the only way to get around is a huge cement spiral star case, staircase to get to the diff different levels. That takes up to an, a whole day to uh, walk the whole thing to get to the depending on where you're going. The story and acting was fantastic throughout. Very intense and plenty of spaces and plenty of dramatic while surrounding the huge mystery surrounding the silo and all the who created it. The other thing was sucked in on the first episode without a doubt. I highly recommend this show and I can't emphasize on how much I highly recommend this. Here's my right now, come back to my thoughts. Definitely not the way I thought it was going to go with the story. Was left a little confused by the last episode, but I crave more of the show. It's that good. We are getting the second season, so that's fantastic. There's definitely so much to this show. In my opinion, the best end of, uh, end of the world story I've seen uh, ever uh, that comes to mind. Well, tell me in the comments below what you guys think. Now, that is all I have for you today. This today. Um, I don't know anything of, with I'll be coming out, but if I put out anything, it'll be Sunday or Monday. Um, but I have to look, so look in the community section if I post to find anything, or if I say I don't have anything. Uh, there is some stuff that are kind of Wander, pondering me if I should check them out or not but it all comes down to money so I check on Netflix if, if there's nothing on Netflix then we'll see we'll see um, but uh, remember I love you all please stay safe spread the love and skull